Well, good evening, Mr. Ashton. Thank you. Cheryl, it's always nice to see you. Angel. You too, Angel. Thank you. Table for two? Please, we're celebrating tonight. Cheryl just took a job with the LQ. Oh, that's wonderful. Congratulations. Thank you. Why? Okay. Right this way. Thanks. You're welcome. Thanks, Angel. Okay. Do you have an appointment, Mr. Um, McKenna. No, no, no I don't. I'm sorry, Dr. Perry doesn't see anyone without an appointment. T tell him, um, tell him Mr. Clayton sent me along. Wait here, please. You too. I I love what you've done to the place. Thank you. Would you like to sit down? Oh no, thank you. I um, Ned's phone call will probably only take a minute. You know, this situation only has to be awkward if we make it that way. You're right. So, <laughs> am I going to have the chance to hear you sing tonight? Well, actually, Frisco will be performing tonight. Oh, mm -hmm. it's too bad. I mean, if you sing half as well as you play... Oh, have you heard me play? Oh, yes. Your Bach to Baroque album is one of my favorites. I was so happy when they finally brought it out on CD. Thanks. Um, may I ask you something? Sure. Are you at all uncomfortable in this situation with me? No. In spite of all the horrible things I'm sure you've heard about me. Uh, no, no, no. No, Robert hasn't said anything about... Uh, of course, he has, he has mentioned you, but he hasn't... Um, not in the way that you think... I understand. Yeah. Look, um, what happened between Robert and me was a long time ago, and it's over. If it wasn't, I wouldn't have come back. From what I can see, he's a very lucky man. You may be the best thing that ever happened to him. And uh, I'd like to wish you both a very long, happy, and successful marriage. Thank you. Thank you. <clears throat> oh, well, oh, well, I'll let you get on with your business. Hi, um, Ned. Mr. McKenna, nice to meet you. Oh, do uh, Doctor, um, uh, Mr. Clayton said you'd see me if I uh, used his name. I have no idea who this Mr. Clayton is. I don't have a patient by that name. Well, he's a lawyer. I don't understand. Is there some kind of lawsuit that no, you're... No, 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 no. Well, maybe if I told you why I'm, uh, I am here. I have patience to see. I won't take long. Really, I won't. All right. Thank you. Uh, my wife and I have been uh, trying <clears throat> unsuccessfully to adopt a child for a number of... Uh, what has that to do with me? Well, she's a, she's a recovering alcoholic. Um, she's been arrested on a number of occasions. Uh, you know, drunk and disorderly, uh, DWI. Uh, you know, bad checks to uh, liquor stores and stuff. I'm not surprised you're having difficulty adopting. Yeah, well, um, <clears throat> uh, she, uh, she bottomed out uh, a few years back and wanted treatment for it. So I, I, I sent her to the best uh, clinics uh, in the country, and uh, she's been clean now for quite a few years. Uh, 
Doctor, I've always got my wife the best that money can buy, with one exception, and that is uh, a baby. Mr. McKenna, you can't just buy a baby. I know. I, I thought that, too, but um, Mr. Clayton, he, he, he said that it could be done. What you're telling me is illegal. This is the most important thing. In the world, to me, doctor, money is no object. I'm sorry, I can't help you. Uh, uh, Mr. Clayton, he mentioned your name before he he disappeared uh, on several occasions. In in what connection? Oh, oh he said that you were friends. And, you know. I, I thought that maybe, maybe you could put me in, in contact with him. I'm sorry, no. Excuse me, doctor, you're going to be late for your next appointment. Mr. McKenzie, for you and your wife, I wish only the best. But if you pursue this, I advise you to go through the proper channels. Any other way would only cause an end in misery and heartbreaks for everyone involved. Believe me. Thank you for your advice. Doctor. Hello. Well, hello, Tony. Hi. How are you doing? I'm fine. Am I interrupting? Not at all. We were just having a little celebration drink here. Cheryl's decided to come to work for us at ELQ. Well, congratulations. Thank you. What, are you alone? Uh, for the moment. Join us. Hey, great. Thanks. Give her, how about a drink? Let me get you. Uh, no, I don't want no? anything. Thanks. Okay. How's Bobby? She's fine. I talked to her earlier. You know, she's just busy. Good. You know, actually, I wanted to apologize to you if I offended you earlier. Um, I'm not sure I know what you're talking about. About the apartment. The apartment? Well, yeah, you know, I was talking about how Bobby and I miss the family atmosphere of the brownstone. And then I sort of segued into that we have a vacant apartment there. And then I looked behind me and you were sort of gone. And I thought maybe you thought I was prying into your life or oh, no, pushing no. you into something. Oh, no, no. I just saw how busy you were with Lucas, so I let myself out. I, I didn't even hear anything about an apartment. So you wouldn't have known about this if I hadn't brought it up? No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, that happens to me. I'll have a patient come in, and he'll say, I'm fine. I'll say, well, <clears throat> don't you hurt? What about right there? And he goes, you know, come to think of it, I don't know. <laughs> now that you mentioned it, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 quite serious. <laughs> you know, that's a good idea. You ought to check the apartment out. Can I rent an apartment or what? Oh. We'd love to have you. I mean, beats the heck out of a hotel. I mean, that's your other option, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. I absolutely promise you, you will not be like a, a live-in babysitter for me. I'm going to make you just a regular, normal tenant. I'm going to charge an arm and a leg, okay? Oh, oh, great. You'll love it. <laughs> um, I guess it doesn't hurt to take a look. Hey, great. Why, why don't you guys go take a look at it? Now? Hey, I'm why free. Not? I'm <laughs> waiting on Frisco and Anna, so... Wait, are you sure that's yeah, okay? Yeah, absolutely. It's fine. I'll just finish my drink here and get the check. I'll be out of here myself. What teamwork I had this whole time. <laughs> yeah, we did it. We did, did. it. I'll yeah, see you Monday right, morning. Well, thank you. Okay. Yeah, bright and early. Okay, good yeah, thanks. Take care. Uh -huh.